Oh my God. God. <laughs> I got you. Okay. That's, that's okay. quite the display you got in the background, player. That's all I'm going to oh, say. You don't see yeah, that, man. Yeah. I, told, I tried to tell them not to show that, man. But, <laughs> but you know. <laughs> but yeah, I mean, it just, it is what it is. You right. Know? Right. <laughs> yeah, because that's got you. You're going to do it. Watch. When it's all said and done, and you go going to get my age, and all you could do is reminisce on history. See, right now, you're still writing your history. But when all you when all you can do is reminisce, you can't ever do it again. You gonna put all your shit back there. All your <laughs> shit back there. Like, oh yeah. Hopefully, I got an, I got as much as what's on that what's on display right now. Golly, that's all good. That's good man. stuff. You just yeah, fired God. me up, man. You just fired me up, man. God, it's been good. That is good. I'm so happy for you, man. I love seeing you do your thing. My God, I appreciate you. How's your son doing? He's doing well. Yeah, he's home now. You know, he's home for on a break. He has one more year. He has one more year, man. We, we always talk about you too, man. I got it, man. I, pre- I got it. You, you know, it's so funny, man, because I don't know it, Travis, but just seeing, you know, the way he act towards you. I remember when I was coming up, I used to get people say, man, can you talk to my kid? I'm like, you talk to your own kid. Why you want me to talk to? No, but then no. when I got a kid, Joker wouldn't listen to the word I say. He'll listen to anything Larry Fitzgerald or anybody says to him. It all makes sense to like, you now. Right, right. And I, you know, I said, that's how God is showing me what it was that I didn't get when I was playing. You know what I mean? <laughs> I said, there you go. There you go. I had a, I had a teammate, Matty Moore, come up to me, QB Matt Moore, and he um, he was saying his son's a big fan. He got the 8-7 jersey and all that, and he's a little one, little one. And he right. was uh, – he was trying to get him to brush his teeth before he went to sleep. He was playing video games or something like that. Like, hey, man, come on. You got to go. And then his mom came in, pointed at a poster on the wall of me, smiling, said, you think Travis brushes, doesn't brush his teeth? Right. You don't think it? Look at those teeth. <laughs> I just he said he said his son threw the controller down, got up all pissed. Like, man, all right. <laughs> That's exactly what I'm talking about. It's amazing, man. It is amazing. But I said, I, said, I get it now. I get, it. I get I'm gonna tell, it. I'm gonna start sending them pictures of taking the trash out, doing everything. Like, yeah, this is what a champ can do, see. baby. This is what a that's champ a, do. That's the influence you have on people, man. That's amazing, man. It's, it's amazing. Cool, man. It's and, and it's cool. good now, we, we get socialized more through social media, that you get to know it. You know what I mean? You get mm-hmm. to know it. People yeah, get to talk about it. that now. We didn't do much of that growing up. So it, it, it's just a beautiful thing. It really is. You're the man. That's the influence you had on me, big guy. Uh, even saying that means a great deal, man. That oh, really seriously. does. That means seriously. Looking up to you and all the movies and stuff. Oh man, let alone what you did on the field, man. Uh, that means all right, guys. Yeah. We're ready to get started here. That's um, all right, man. Hey, everybody, thank you for joining us for today's Super Bowl Fifty Five media availability with Kansas City Chiefs tight end Travis Kelsey. Uh, Travis, you ready to get started? I'm ready to get rolling, man. All right, we're gonna go first to Michael Irvin. Go ahead, Michael. Oh, Travis, how you doing, buddy? All right, Travis, I'm going to jump right into this. I know hey, you have one Super Bowl. Your brother, Jason, he has one Super Bowl. How important is it for you to win this Super Bowl so you can go home and have bragging rights? Woo! Ali, you know, you know those bragging rights at the dinner table, everything, man. And I'll tell you what, I didn't have too many of those bragging rights growing up in the house. Uh, him being two years older than me, I got pushed around a little bit. Uh, obviously, it, it worked out for the for the better, but I um I think this one uh, this one might take the cake. This one <laughs> just this one might might be the the bragging rights of them all, man. To get to get another one, and I mean uh, just to just to I don't know the fact that we both made it to the mountaintop, and then to let them know I I made it twice. I mean it's it's already there, but I, I got to go out here and get this ring to get the job done. That is quite an accomplishment, man. Both brothers already making it to the mountaintop, getting those Super Bowls. Congratulations to both of you guys. And also, congratulations is in order. Five straight 1,000-yard seasons. Never done before by a tight end, let alone talk about done five times in a row. Is there any way the Bucs can stop you one-on-one? I mean, I'm talking to a fellow guy that knows knows how dominant he can be. I think – um. You got to have that confidence. You got to have that 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 men, that beast mentality that I cannot be stopped. And um, I, I've acquired that over the eight years I've played here. Um, had a, I've had a lot a lot of help uh, through guidance in terms of Coach Bienemy, Coach uh, Andy Reid, um, keeping keeping the 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 competitive edge and uh, and and helping me um, evolve into a into a you know 
what I what I've been able to to show out on the field. But I am um, just I'm very fortunate, man, to to be able to stay on stay out there on the field the way I have over the past uh, five years doing this and um, or really throughout my career and uh, just very very blessed, very fortunate. Uh, to be in the position, man, because not a lot of guys get this opportunity. TK, earlier, man, you sent cheers up my, uh, up my arms and everything when you came and sat down and you saw you had Tyreek Hill right there with you. It, it took me back to my Jay Novacek days. Me and Jay Novacek, my tight end, we lockered right uh -huh. next to each other, man. Tell me about that relationship. And will you and Tyreek Hill go down? We, are you looking to go down as the best tight end wide receiver combination ever? I, I, without a doubt, man, I, I feel like it, it, it's it's something that's never really been talked about between me and him. Um, but we know what we're both capable of and uh, we know how much we feed off of each other's success and what we what we can do to help each other get open out there on the field. Um, Coach Reed and, and Pat and the offensive staff have done an unbelievable job of just making this offense uh, friendly for the for the guys in it, meaning that we're always in an opportunity to have success as players. And, and when you can get that opportunity game in, game out, and, and on top of that, do it with guys that you, that you love being in the locker room with, you love hanging out uh, outside of the locker room with just great people, man, it's, um, it, it builds a bond, it builds a brotherhood, and it builds a family that, uh, that, that you can just enjoy coming into work every single day with, man. I know you're a sneakerhead, man. What's your most prized sneaker? Man, that's a good one, man. I got a lot of them on the top of the list. I think uh, one of my favorites is definitely um, the Marty McFly's, man. The 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 Back to the Futures, the Air Mag, Nike Air Mags that were in the original movie. I think back in nineteen eighty nine or the the eight the late eighties, early nineties. I was I wasn't even born yet, so I, I don't even know when the movie actually came out, man. But I know when I saw it, um, I had to get a pair. I had to, and it was one of my first purchases when I uh, I got a contract in the NFL. Hey, one last question, man. You know, a couple of years ago, we were at Pro Bowl. We all talked about it. that's when you were up and coming. And it mm -hmm. was Grump and Tyree and, and, and Travis Kelsey coming up to take over. You have clearly taken over that top spot. But you now you got Grump on the other side. How much of that, how much have you thought about getting a chance to play against Grump in the Super Bowl? Well, I mean, uh, Grump's career has been unbelievable unbelievable is going to go down in history as one of the best players that have ever played this game on top of that his his season I think 2011 when he had 1300 yards and 17 touchdowns and then went into the super went all, took his team all the way to the Super Bowl the guy is an unbelievable person talent you name it man I might be one of the biggest Gronk fans out there let it be told man and it's uh just to see his career and how he's been able to go get through all the ups and downs, handling adversity, leaving the game, coming back. Se it seems like he loves it all over again. Um, I'm just happy as heck for him to be able to reach the mountain peak uh, all over again, man. But it's, uh, you know, it's, it's, it's a little bit personal, man. You got, it's gotta be that way. You know, I'm, I'm here and I'm playing this game to be the best, the best that I can be and uh, to be the best that I can be for my team um, on every single play. And uh, with that, it comes with um, holding yourself to a high standard. And, uh, and, and I think that um, over the course of my career, one, I've been very fortunate to stay on the field, but two, um, been very fortunate to get uh, matched up with uh, Tyreek Hill and Pat Mahomes because those two guys, man, uh, they're, they're, legendary. They're, they're legendary in their own right and um, have definitely made my game uh, go up since I've been playing with them. So keep doing what you're doing, buddy. Appreciate you taking the time. Good luck. You're the man, Mike. Have a good one, big dog. All right.